Hey y'all, Pinhead here, and it's time for another safety message. You ever notice, you ever watch someone uh, walking a tightrope like in the circus, and they either got their hands out to the side of them, or they got a bar or something? Why do you think that is? They're not trying to pretend they're an airplane. That's so they can make these little adjustments to maintain their balance. So the first part of this is when you're walking out there back and forth to your car or to the bus and you know it could be slippery don't walk with your hands in your pocket and don't carry a bunch of stuff that you don't need to be carrying back and forth. You want to keep your, your hands, your arms out there where if you, you ever notice when you start to slip or you start to lose your balance your arms do things that you didn't tell them to do that's because the brain is already worked out in a couple milliseconds here losing traction ground hard avoid pain all this happens like that so if you got your hands all in your pocket well my hands get cold well get you some gloves or mittens or something to walk around but keep your arms out there where you can make these little subtle adjustments here to keep your balance right so you're not bouncing off the icy pavement out here that's one thing so that leads me to the next which is prepare and dress appropriately for the conditions have your hat and your scarf and enough layers of clothes on in um, your mittens or your gloves or whatever which leads me to the next thing leave with enough time to where you're not hurrying and rushing around and trying to go burning around icy corners on foot and, and end up breaking a bone or something causing a bigger problem because you don't want to be late and you didn't give yourself enough time to get your stuff together and get where you need to go and the last thing about this is use the tools that were given to you if you got shoe grips everyone should have them and you're regularly out there walking around on these conditions use them shoe grips it's to protect you and help you do what you gotta do without getting yourself hurt or worse so that's it I hope this helped you and, and I know you heard it before but just to remind you use these things that you already know use your sense and keep yourself safe we see you on the next one until then take care bye I know what some of y'all are thinking somebody that works on the team here you see them as representing the company and you think maybe well the company is just trying to save money and these things cost money so it's all about the money and I can see where you'd go down that road but at the same time you need to know this I'm not getting any kind of bonus if you don't get hurt or if the company makes a lot of money or doesn't my paycheck still clears just like yours so why would I be doing this why would I want to stop you from hurting yourself I must care about you enough to not want you to get hurt right I mean doesn't that make sense so let's leave all that suspicion and uh, being cynical and, and negative and all that sitting over there somewhere and look at the facts on this and and make sure your perception is right bye